What's going on legends? Welcome back to another Call of Duty Warzone mobile video. Now, you're probably wondering, what have I even got to speak about in this video? Well, what if I said potentially there could be multiplayer coming? And what if I told you I've actually found some images that you might be interested in? So stick around, drop a like and subscribe. Let's hop straight into it. All right, guys, if you haven't been on social media lately, then you probably wouldn't have even known about anything I'm about to tell you now. But if you are on social media and you've missed it, well, guess what? I'm here to bring it to you right now. Warzone Mobile is set to be releasing anytime soon. We've had an alpha, a private alpha test now that we're all fully aware of, which was called Project aurora now what is next in line i already explained this in my previous video we have a brand new event coming out on september the 15th or 14th i can't exactly remember but it's called the call of duty next actually located in la and loads of creators are being flown out there to test out warzone mobile to test out modern warfare 2 and to test out warzone 2 i think it's called i'm not too sure on the pc side of things but warzone mobile will be getting tested out now i know that there have been creators that have already been testing the game out and unfortunately they've already broken their nda by actually leaking footage i'm not actually going to be showing you any gameplay footage videos but i am definitely going to be showing you some images that i've actually stumbled across on twitter first one being what does the main menu look like here it is on screen right now so as you can see the dude's actually watermarked his name which is a silly plonker to do because i did that in apex and i got screwed over for it but anyways as you can see on the on the top left here i'm guessing this is where you add your friends in there so trios looks like it's the maximum you can do right now because quads looks like it's locked at the moment of course this was alpha as you can see at the top this is not representative of the final quality when they do tests they always downscale everything and the test is mainly to see if there's any crucial bugs nothing to do with optimization now this may look very bland to you but it is an alpha it's very simplistic and i can tell you now i guarantee this has completely changed since i'm showing you now now moving on then i actually found this image of warzone mobile the actual store so when you're actually in the br game mode you go up to a store and you can buy the cluster strike position airstrike so there you go on screen right here this this is what we can see that you can buy of course this isn't all of it but as you can see, you know, you're collecting money um, and also teammates money up the top as well. So that is slightly different to what Warzone has on PC and console. You can see your own money and you can see your teammates money as well. Now, can you spend your teammates money without them dropping it to you? We don't know yet, but that'd be an awesome idea to be able to have that. Also kind of annoying as well if people just keep buying random stuff when you want to buy a loadout. Now the next image then guys is a new game mode that popped up and it's called Blitz Royale. I'm not going to go into detail what Blitz Royale is. It's just another BR game mode in the game. Now people are fully aware that this is in the main game. And how do we know that it's going to be in the mobile game? Well, anyone that actually had access to the alpha, they still get notifications even though that alpha has stopped they get notifications from the game end like the game engine sending their device like notifications like hey log in today we had the same thing that happened in apex legends mobile now blitz royale was one of the notifications that popped up moving forwards then the weapons that are completely confirmed in the game currently which was in the alpha now bear in mind there are going to be a lot more weapons added um these are just all the weapons that have been 100 confirmed so here's a list we got the rpg ak-47 m 4 a one x16 hk psg1 ax50 the old combat knife and the rao mg now if you're wondering what any of these weapons look like here is an image on screen for you here now you may be thinking well that's not a lot of weapons but this was for an alpha remember now coming up into this event on september the 15th 14th whenever it is the call of duty next event we should be seeing a lot more weapons and remember there's some live gameplay that we're going to see so i am making so many videos now because i'm actually kind of pumped to see what is coming up i love the progression of games but moving on guys to the most crucial part of the video and the part of the video where you've clicked on the video warzone mobile multiplayer what the hell you're such a liar that's not coming why what are you lying for well what if i told you why would a company here is an image on screen why would a company that is making absolutely bank this is per month look millions and millions and millions of dollars per month not include multiplayer in a brand new Call of Duty title coming to mobile. Now, if we look at PC and console, they've got a new Call of Duty every year or every two years. Now, why would mobile not actually come into this route? Because if, believe it or believe it not, Call of Duty Mobile has made more revenue than PC and console combined. Now, that's kind of bizarre, right? Now, let me show you an image here real quick. 
I just, I feel comfortable, you know? Here is an image of loadouts. You know, I don't, I don't I, to be honest, I don't care about what the loadouts look like, but this was on Twitter. Now, if you take a look at the top right, compiling shaders, multiplayer. Compiling shaders, multiplayer. Multiplayer. Oh, but I'm a... It's probably going to be just multiplayer when it means Battle Royale. Well, it definitely could mean that. But it could also mean that we are having multiplayer coming into Warzone MOBA. And it would make sense. Why would it make sense? Well, if we take a look at Warzone on PC and console, when you want to rank up your weapons, then you can just go on to, the, you know, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. Uh, sorry, you can just go on to Call of Duty Modern Warfare. You can jump onto Cold War. You can rank up your weapons. But on Warzone Mobile, how are we going to rank up the weapons without going into Battle Royale and ranking them up? And they take ages to rank up because you've only got Battle Royale to rank up in. It would make perfect sense, wouldn't it? That they would include multiplayer so you can go into multiplayer, rank up your weapon, ready for Warzone. It makes completely sense. Now, what if I told you that if this is, if this is the case, how would you feel if it was in the game? Now, to me, I truly believe that this is going to be coming to the game because there's so much revenue being made in COD Mobile. And remember, COD Mobile is getting on a bit now. And there is new technology advancing when it comes to the actual engines they're building the game on. Now, if you guys remember back to a game called Combat Master, I've covered the game on my channel a couple of times. That was a game that pretty much looked like Call of Duty Modern Warfare on mobile, but they got copyrighted. Now, why would they get copyrighted if Activision didn't have something in the future coming to mobile that they thought, oh, wow, this Combat Master is a risk. Now, that's all I'm saying, guys. You don't need to believe me, but looking at these sources and looking at the evidence, it looks like we may have multiplayer coming towards our mobile. Now, 100% certain? No. 99% certain, yes, because there's always that slight chance that it might not be coming. But let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And I hope this video has really entertained you guys. We are so close to 100,000 subs. So drop a like, subscribe, and I'll see you again real soon. Peace out.